Yes, one year. We were ready. A lot of preparedness happened uh, on the, for, for this work. And actually, I put the video together. Uh, I remember that was very emotional for me because um, I found that, that Ghana was actually the very first country in the world to receive vaccines under the COVID regime. So. Uh, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not our star. But then I see, yes, Afghanistan, uh, Tanya from Nepal, a lot of smiles. Look at all of them smiling, happy to receive these vaccines. Other um, uh, partners, um, Gavi, CEPI, WHO. And everyone was really nervous and everyone was feeling hopeful. We were going to be the first in the MENA region. A lot of partners, um, but this is only the vaccines. Then you have the devices, you have the freezers, you have working with the government on the readiness, making sure that we administrate the campaign. I mean, this day was such a major milestone. I mean, it was just the start. We celebrated every time vaccines arrived in every country, so 143 other times. We are ready. It's not finished. We will keep delivering in 2022. Oh, this, this, is, this was really nice to watch. Uh, yeah, life-saving vaccine, life-saving. Yeah. And so many, many people are, are benefited from this. The grass is more and then yeah. all yeah. sorts of and there is no difference. There is no difference. There is no difference. There is. And it was a sense of relief, you know, because 2020 was such a difficult year. It was so difficult and 2021 was going to be the year we get the vaccine. Hope, solution to this uh, ongoing pandemic. So uh, yeah, and um, a sense of pride as well. We achieved something together.